Hello, hello, and welcome to Games Revisited. It's episode 33, and uh, we're continuing our playthrough of Star Wars Knights of the Old Republic to the Sith Lords. We're, uh, we're playing with a new weapon, our Force Pike. Uh, that looks like it could be kind of fun. Uh, I'm not entirely sure that that's a net benefit right now, but uh, we'll give it a shot. And we're... This should look awfully familiar because we were here before. Uh, the last time, though, we, uh, we ran into a little problem on the beach. And uh, we hadn't saved in a while. So we're going to try this again. Except this time we're going to resolve the issue... Yeah, you know, that the whole lack of saves thing. And I'm filling the map in because I'm a completionist like that. And it gives me something to do while I'm yakking at the beginning and making sure that uh, we're all on the same page or something like that. All right. That really does not look like a safe way to run with the force pike, by the by. Uh and it really wasn't until I started playing the Knights of the Old Republic games that I get a better idea of what Force Pikes were. I, I actually thought that they were um, uh, a little more... more tightly related to Jedi-type stuff than they appear to be. Another sentry droid. The mercenaries must be using them to locate us. There's probably another patrol nearby. Alright. Let's do this one quick. Zap him. Zap him again. And let's flurry with a two-handed weapon, which is what we're ultimately going to go with. Ooh, that was kind of nice. I mean, let's be honest. A as soon as I get uh, a chance to start building lightsabers, it's going to be dual sabers all the way. I ain't playing with those. Not this time. What luck! We did not expect to see you again. Uh, let's try a different answer. The benefit of going through twice. You seem happy to see me. And why would I? When we saw you, you we could not believe our luck. Oh, okay. So, conversation doesn't seem to be any different either way you go about it. Wait, bounty? Why is there a bounty on your head? Uh, it's a long story. Don't you know? The exchange is paying handsomely. Yada, yada, yada. Your friend is... Uh, look, guys, I, I'm not a Jedi. I'm a Jedi exile. I don't think so. You'll have to come through me if you want to take the general. Okay. Let's uh do the rock'em sock'em thing and... Bam. Shield. And start flurrying the ever living snot. And let's, uh. Shield. Hmm. Let's, uh, double up on, uh, short stuff on the left first. Let's try the flurry. See if that, uh, that helped. Let's get a shield. And I'd actually rather have Force Valor first, then Energy Resistance, and then the uh, Force Barrier. And yet you run up and attack him anyway. Come on. Lady, I swear I am about to end you. Journal entry added. Alright. I'm seriously ready to just start directly taking control of her and then uh, everybody else. Alright. Good. I guess this means we can take care of the critters now instead of uh, later. But I thought one of these guys had stuff on him. Ooh. And maybe... Maybe that's the deal. 
if we can take care of these guys before they meander over to the mercenaries. Alright. Let's cancel combat. Let's head over here. Let's save our game before bad things happen again. And we get a bad bad feeling of deja vu again. Alright, let's see if this doesn't help kite. Oh, you bum. Get him! Oh, 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 oh. Okay. So far, so good, right? Oh, alright. Good. We did a little bit better this time. Let's uh, grab our grenade out of the bag. Let's uh, do our blurry run over by the beach. Uh, I guess that's as good as we're going to get. Let's try to do our special chat. I always feel a sense there we go. When I walk the surface of Telos. The are Hello, Beach Duck. Their work. The force is strong here. Whether Chodo and his herd has anything to do with that is another matter. Can you feel anything? Alright, we'll stick with our original answer and go with a whisper, perhaps. That is good. As a breeze may swiftly turn to a gale, you are slowly beginning to be reopened to the force. Quiet. There's a large mercenary patrol up ahead. If you move carefully along... Yeah, the oh, believe me, I am well aware of that patrol up ahead. Us. We could cross along the shore, or head along the cliffs to the south. All right, let's try going along the shore again. This time without following all the little beasties into an attack until we're ready for it. All right, this guy should be far enough away that we should be able to start start things up over here and then backtrack for the mercenary patrol. How do you like that? Hello again, Beach Duck. How you doing? This won't take long. Oop. Come on. Get him. Get the critter. Take him down. That's what I want you guys to do. Take him down. I still think those guys should produce leather or something. Or is that getting a little too World of Warcrafty? Or, uh, Skyrim or <laughs> something like that. Ooh, he does have something this time. What's he got? Do I want to know how he got an ion grenade? No, I don't want to know how he got an ion grenade. Although maybe it was off of that body over there. All right, first things first, before we do anything else, save the game. We've made progress. I would like to not lose it again. <laughs> I'm sorry. I, I just love that. And I would like to not lose it again. Dramatic music! Dun dun! Okay. <clears throat> sorry. I'm easily amused at the moment. Alright. What's, uh, what's this journal entry that it keeps going? Oh. The, uh, the bounty. So that means when I get back up to the Citadel station, and I deeply suspect I'll be back up there before too, too long, uh, I'll be able to uh, get the bounty on those two, which will be nice. I like money. Um, and I guess, I guess, I, yeah, I, I should end up having a return there because those quests aren't just hanging out for nothing. They, they got to be there for, for some reason. All right, um, what do we got over here? We've got a random container. 
a random container with some light armor and a med pack. I'm getting an awful lot of armor that I can't use. No, I know. I wanted to see what was on the body. <sighs> Come on. That's empty. Hi, hi, hi. You, you give me the indicator like there's something there to pick up. Alright. Something over there at least. Alright. I'm seeing the little indicator like there should be. Uh, I think we're back to uh, one of the problems with Knights of the Old Republic 2 is that it was on a firm deadline. Which meant that it got released with more than a few bugs and other problems. Alright. There's only one beastie there. We've already saved, right? Alright, let's do this. Leroy Jenkins. Nah, let's stick with the flurries. That seems to work better. Oh, there's more than one beastie over there. Alright. I definitely need to get an energy shield in the mix. And I need you to get an energy shield in the mix. And get you a battle stimulant and then you can go about whatever else it was that you're planning on doing. Let's get you a battle shield in the mix. And then some more attacks. Seriously. I'm gonna spend all this time on the critters. Take them down. Focus this guy. Gamma. Yes, let's stand in the middle of everything. Yeah. Maybe I should give everybody that feat that gives you bonuses when you double down on somebody. That might make these go a little bit easier. You're not looking healthy, good sir. You need a med pack on yourself. Let us end this. All right, and I'm looking okay at the moment. So yeah, let's uh, get those flurries in. This is definitely going better than it did the last time. What are you doing? What are you doing? All right. Cool. What do we get on the remains? We got 120 bucks. Always useful. Uh, land speeders locked. We got some remains with an advanced med pack. Yeah, we are going to start using more of those soon, too. I bet that's locked. Yep. Okay. Anything else? No, I don't see any other bodies or anything. At least not that uh, aren't already looted. Let's do this before we do anything else. Let's save again. Yep, I'm sure I want to save it. 
Okay. Alright, deep breath. Breathe in and breathe out. I am one with the force. The force is with me. Or something like that. Or do we not like that movie? <laughs> it had its problems. I will say that. It did have its problems. But I don't think it was as bad as uh, it was made out to be. Alright, so this is where we're going to switch to Mr. Demolitions. Put him in solo mode. And let him do his recovery options because um, this will help us unlock doors later if it comes to it. And even if it doesn't help us unlock doors, we can either sell the mines for credits or... Uh, what's more likely to happen, break them down for parts to build other stuff with them. So I do want to recover as much as I possibly can. So let's turn solo mode back off. Let's get me back in charge. And have at least two hidden caches like this. I know, we found the first one already. Ooh. Sound Dampening Overlay Mark II. Another Mandalorian melee shield, which is good. We haven't been using too many of those because we haven't been engaging in much melee combat. Everybody's shooting. All right. So that wasn't bad. What's in the second hidden gash? Security Tunneler, Life Support Pack, Advanced Med Pack. We are getting the Advanced Med Packs a little bit earlier than it seems like we did in Knights of the Old Republic 1. I am moderately surprised about that. I'm also deeply debating on uh, whether I want to keep cranking up my level right now or not. Alright, uh, that looks like it's going to be a dead end-ish. Uh, skeletons, not good. Backpack, ooh, Sith War Sword. It is a melee weapon, upgradable, always nice. Three to 17, hello. All right. Oh, oh yeah. Yes, yes. <laughs> and this one's upgradable, I, I like that part too. Uh, so, let's see. Let's just double check. Let's go back to the Force Pike. Yeah, so that was 5 to 15 damage plus 11 on attack. 3 to 13 plus 9 on the offhand. And that goes up to 6 to 20 plus 11. 4 to 18 plus 9. Uh, yes please. I will happily take the Sith War Sword. Uh, hang on. I need to take care of something real quick. And time out. Oh, come on. No, this is not a politics channel. Not at all. All right, where was I? Uh, I was going to come over here, and instead of leveling him up, 
I was gonna see since I've since I'm no longer using the longsword I was before. Yeah, let's um let's get him up to that longsword that I'm no longer needing. And she's already got a longsword. All right, there we go. Everybody's looking a little bit better on the equipment front. Let's go ahead and save the game again, just because uh, stuff's happened, and I don't like losing track of where things are at. Okay. All right. Is there anything else? Hmm, there is another bag. Flex heavy armor. Flex heavy armor. That's the light battle armor. All right, that's a medium armor. Uh, that means Barado could probably use that. Oh, that's a heavy armor. But it does have a max dex bonus, which is nice. And it's going to keep flashing at me like I'm missing something if I don't click on those. All right, there we go. Nice. Okay, picked up a couple of nice things. And... Let's see. That, I believe that takes care of everything we can do at the beach for now. There's nothing else over here, right? Nope. Just double checking what notes I had ready. Yeah, it keeps giving me the, the indicator like you can loot those guys, and clearly you can't. Alright, so. That looks like we got trouble ahead, so let's do this. Let's uh, take a... I'm going to take a little break on the live stream. Uh, I'm going to... This will be where the YouTube episode ends, so uh, give me just a minute. And we'll get things squared away for the next little bit. Well, that was fun. Unless I just died. Then it was a little less than fun. I hope you've enjoyed. I hope you're having fun. And if you want to watch live, you can follow along on Twitch. I live stream the recording of the next six episodes at least once a week. I might even throw in some bonus content here and there if time allows. And you'll find the link in the description below. Also, if you haven't already, please subscribe to the YouTube channel. That way you'll get notified when new episodes go up live stream archives from some of my other stuff and various and sundry other videos because I do more than just this. And if you want to get notifications, don't forget to hit the bell. And if you really, truly enjoyed it, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and all that good fun stuff. If you have any questions, queries, quips, quotes, comments, complaints, or other whatnot, don't forget to leave those in the comments down below. Lastly, if you're enjoying the show, if you're getting some value out of it, then consider giving a lot of value back. Go to live.anonjunior.com. It'll take you to the Streamlabs page where you can tip or donate, however you want to think about it. And there's no preset amount because this is a straight up value for value proposition. So if you're getting value out of the show and you would like to give a little value back, even if it's just enough for a cheap cup of coffee, then uh, consider going, giving a little bit especially if it tickled the nostalgia or opened your eyes to a new game that you might play. And uh, with all that said and done, we're, uh, we're going to cut out, have fun, enjoy, and I'll see you next time.